Yo, what's up? You're watching Climber Cringe, and this is your host, Justin Wallace. <laughs> I finally decided to get a new microphone so it doesn't sound like I'm in a sandstorm while I'm talking. Kind of sweet. I'm still trying to figure out how it w exactly it works, but I think I think I get it. Today, we will be looking at one of my all-time favorite videos called How to Survive a Free Solo, and it makes me laugh so hard every time just because of the pure stupidity of the guy in this. Just simply the name of it, How to Survive a Free Solo. Free soloing shouldn't be about just purely surviving the solo. Let's dive into this one. Of course it's in Pennsylvania. Freaking boondocks. Grab your balls, Rat. Bye bye. What the hell is the deal with this camera? I feel like I'm looking out of a fish tank or something. Here's Mike soloing. Grab your balls. Grab your balls. <laughs> I can't say that without laughing. Because when you're soloing, essentially you're soloing well under your ability of sport climbing. Because you're soloing stuff that you know you're not going to fall. Right. What do you think? <laughs> so if you've never seen the movie Free Solo before and you're not too familiar with the whole idea of free soloing, a big part of free soloing and climbing in general is that you really want to be confident in your climbing ability when you're doing stuff that could be potentially dangerous, such as soloing. And you do this by doing something that to you is like climbing a ladder because you're really confident that you're not going to fall off the ladder. But, you know, stuff happens. Yeah. Yeah. And, well, what happens is you get cockier and cockier. Not cockier, you get more confident with your ability. And you just want to step it up and step it up and go harder and harder. Well, eventually. The guy asks, you're going to fall? And he goes, eventually. I'm like, geez, dude, you just talked about confidence. And now you're saying you're gonna fall? Make up your mind. John Backer. He fucking was just soloing and just probably wasn't thinking and out of nowhere. A little guy? foot slip and it's over. Dude soloed like shit. Like he soloed fucking 513. Fucking 513. That's, That's five how nine. fucking badass he is. I'm climbing 5'9". And fell on a 5'10". One of the best in the world, they say. There might be nobody that ever compared to him. Look at the intensity in his eyes. He's ready to go. I really like the serious tone of this video. Because this video is not something that should be taken seriously. an addiction that ends in death. I guess we don't like that. I'm not addicted. <laughs> <laughs> not me. No way. Oh. You're an idiot. Let's take a real close look at what exactly happened here. It kind of looks like his foot slipped. Holy shit. I'm fine. Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh boy. I'm fine. <laughs> How the fuck are you not dead? That's exactly what you want to hear from your friends when you're climbing with them. Ah! As soon as your adrenaline calms down a little bit, you're gonna be a. Uh, <laughs> 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 I've never fallen on that. 
Oh, you fucking shit! Where are you? What's that? Get the fucking top! Where's yeah, the top? That? I don't know. Oh, you like thought too, you're like conscious and trying to. Like grab? Oh, like, yeah, you're like, oh shit, I knew what was happening? I don't know, I went up there, I grabbed, you know, I grabbed yeah. it, I was reaching up for the hole, right and all of a sudden my foot just went whoop! I was like, rope! <laughs> There's the rope! <laughs> I think my addiction just got, you know, kicked out of me a little bit. <laughs> I'll stick with like 5.8 and below soloing. I think you should stick to a, a little lower than 5.8. That's good. <laughs> Guy can't even go up his own stairs. So that's all for this episode of Climber Cringe. Thanks for watching. These are honestly pretty fun to make and they're not too much work so as long as you guys like them i'll probably just keep putting them out